Despite more than 8 billion humans on Earth, there are three times more chickens than people. And even if we count the total weight of every human body combined, the biomass, our species still weighs less than ants. Humans are not the largest, not the strongest, not even the longest lived. Some sharks and turtles live well beyond 200 years. Corals and sponges survive for thousands, and certain jellyfish can reverse aging itself restarting the cycle of life endlessly. Without accidents or predators, they might even be immortal. Compared to that, humans are shockingly fragile. A starfish can regrow an entire body from a single arm. The thorny devil lizard can survive years without drinking, feeding only on the dew that gathers on its skin. And then there's the tardigrade. This tiny creature makes us look delicate, pathetic even. It can endure toxic, salty environments for decades. Temperatures hotter than 150 degrees Celsius or colder than minus 270 degrees Celsius, even in the vacuum of space. Humans, by comparison, can withstand only a narrow range of temperatures. Our skin is thin, our organs, vulnerable. Our physiology, fragile. And yet, somehow, against all odds, we survived. But when measured against the resilience of life all around us, doesn't humanity's supposed domination feel almost insignificant? <laughs>